Hello everybody, welcome back to part 8 of how to build your own raffle website. So in this video, we want to go through exactly how to set your winners, not only in the product level, which is basically in here. So once you select a winner in here, their details and stuff will appear uh, here instead of the question and answer uh, and details, uh, but also how to add them to the winner section at the top right. So that's adding a picture, you know, a title, what ticket number won, the date of the draw, what they won, and maybe some information. Uh, and that'll obviously, these tiles, these tile looking things, will uh, just stack one on top of each other on this page. So I'll go through how to do that as well. So first of all, I want to go back to the home page and actually go to the test product that we, we made. So... All I need to do is go to the products on the left hand side, all products. Go to the test raffle, we just made that in the last video. So what I'm going to do is actually edit that. And I'm going to change the minimum tickets to zero and this to five. And then I'm going to purchase all the tickets. Okay, so we're going to update that. And then view product. So there's going to be a maximum of five tickets. So I'm going to go ahead and buy them all. So you just so you can see exactly what happens on uh, checkout and what happens after uh, a product gets um, sold out. So that's it us there so one more thing actually sorry so one more thing we actually need to make that a live product or a live competition so if we go back to the dashboard go back to the all products and back to the test raffle on the right hand side here we're just going to keep that live for now because it's just finished so when it's complete that's when you've already picked your winner so we'll go back to the home page and you'll see the test raffle is here. So test raffle, please be patient. We're picking our winner. So that'll, this is what will come up uh, when it, when it's completely sold out. So that's obviously just like a pending, we're waiting for the live draw. So then we would go to uh, number generator in Google and then we can go, oh, so minimum, one and five. There we go. Number four, one. You'd obviously do that in live stream or however you want to run it. Uh, but you would then go back to your product. So all products and back in the test raffle. Go all the way down. And see where it says manual winner picking. So that's where we want to add uh, the ticket that just won. So that was ticket number four. Uh, Ticket number four. So adding those details, that'll obviously choose this guy as the winner or whoever it is as the winner. Uh, and then some text to go along with that. So we'll go ahead and go back to the top and update that. So that's updated that product to the winner. And then if we go back to here where you say where you seen earlier, that was just the please be patient, we're picking the winner. Now we've picked it, you'll be, congratulations, you are the winner. That's if you're logged in. So I'm logged in as the winner. So the winner is Ryan. It gives the first name of the winner, ticket number four. And then obviously uh, what we added in at the bottom of the page, I'll just go back to show you here, congrats, is now here, just under the ticket number. So that means you can give a, a personal message uh, on that uh, competition. Okay, so now that's done. Everyone's happy. Uh, they, can, they You can leave these on your homepage. So if someone uh, clicks here, it says view winners now instead of enter competition. So there you go. But say you, you only want live um, competitions on your homepage, you would then go up to the top and click on complete. You only want one category live at one point or 
one complete either it's complete or it's live so we're going to keep that as complete that means it's still available if people click the, uh, have a link they can still go to it uh, and you'd usually set it to complete after maybe a few days of people uh, visiting this but also I think it's great to have a winners section so that gives us more control over what we say and do uh, and obviously at the bottom here have a, a nice wee carousel of exactly who's won uh, some more information than just uh, who the winner is here um, also it's good for people browsing to see you know what past competitions you've done uh, that kind of thing so to add a winner to the winners section it's just go up the left hand side and click uh, prize winner so you can see all winners here so you can see that there's two winners already showed you those before we'll go ahead and add new so test raffle winner the winner was Ryan so I won what did I win I won the test raffle whatever that means uh, it was drawn today so say you have a Facebook live or some kind of um, live feed of the draw it would be good to copy and paste the URL into here so say you know after a, a live video finishes saves it as a video well in there you can then copy so it would be like uh, www.facebook.com dot com and then slash it'd be like you know a mad url after it but it would link directly to this competition's uh, winning draw uh, and then at the bottom but this is i think this is optional uh, and if, if anything isn't filled in um it'll not show on the front end so the winning ticket number was number four uh, and then just sort of a load of information here uh, and then on the right hand side you want to set a featured image for this winner so let's set a featured image for the lack of any better images that I have in here let's just click that one and then just click publish at the top right okay so it must be a valid URL and while that looks like a valid URL to the normal people I think it needs uh, HTTPS and then this wee world will probably light up so it needs to be a full link so if I publish that validation successful and then we're done so good thing about this is that's all you need to do uh, to add it to not only your winner section so we'll go back to the website visit site so not only is it going to be added to in here you can kind of see that loading up now but it'll also be added to the winner section up here. All right, okay, so you see uh, our new winner just there. We can click onto that. Congratulations to Ryan, the winning ticket, because there could be more than one ticket number. Uh, so they won the test raffle, which was the, the prize that I added in. The winner drawn uh, today, and here's the Facebook link. So that would be a link directly off the website uh, to the the live stream uh, and then just some information at the bottom uh, obviously this does crop the image to a perfect uh, rectangle and that's just for when you're on mobile optimization and all the rest of it it just it just makes sure that the image you upload is just basically a landscape um, or like a horizontal image uh, and it'll look the best so hopefully uh, that a um, small video there helps you with a few more details about how the site works uh, and any questions do let me know all the best cheers